Hello, my name is Sian Park. I am really happy to introduce Dokseong Palace to you. The places I will introduce today are Yuhyeonmun Gate, Dukjodang Hall, and Jumyeongdang Hall. I hope you will enjoy our trip. Then let's begin our trip. Yuhyeonmun Gate is a rainbow-shaped arch door. Yuhyeonmun means a door that a wise enters. As the name suggests, passing through this gate gets smarter. So when Princess Dokke, the youngest daughter of the Emperor Gojong, had to pass through Yuhyeonmun Gate when going to the kindergarten, which installed inside the palace. It was also the place where Emperor Gojong saw of Princess Dokke, who went to kindergarten. On the top of the Yuhyeonmun, there is a dragon pattern, and on the other side is a crane with a harp of eternal use in its mouth. Jumyeongdang Hall and Dukjodang Hall are connected by a corridor. Dukjodang Hall literally means the house where kings and kings ascended their throne. Historically, two kings, King Gwangyegun and King Injo, ascended their throne in here. Until Jungajeon Hall was built, it served as the official main hall, and after Jungajeon Hall was completed, it served as a king's office hall. Also, this place was used as a queen arms bedchamber after Emperor Gojong was forced to abdicate. She was the royal concubine of Emperor Gojong. She was originally a court lady who attended to Empress Myeongseong. But after the Empress Myeongseong's death, the queen um, played an essential role in helping the Emperor Gojong. Gaining trust from the Emperor Gojong, she was promoted from a court lady to a queen and gave birth to King Yongjin. Before Hamnyeongjeon Hall was built, Jumyeongdang Hall was a temporary residence of Emperor Gojong and used as an, as an office and reception hall. Emperor Gojong got Princess Dokke at the age of 60. Emperor Gojong loved her greatly and established a kindergarten for her in Jumyeongdang. Handrails were installed to keep the children during playtime. You can see the holes where a handrail was fixed. Princess Dokke was born as a daughter of the Emperor Gojong and court lady Yang in 1912. Princess Dokke was not formally recognized as a princess by Japan because she was not a daughter of the queen. In 1917, her name was formally entered into the Imperial Families Registry. After the Emperor Gojong suddenly passed away, the Princess Dokke, who had been forced to leave for Japan at the age of 13, led a painful life in Strangeland. Princess Dokke had an arranged marriage with a count in Japan, but her daughter ended her life by committing suicide and she divorced her husband after an unhappy marriage. She finally returned to her home country in 38 years later at the age of 51. After a long illness, she ended her sorrowful life in Naksanje, Changdeokgung Palace. Thank you for listening.